good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I am back with another fun, fast laser project. So let's get cracking. Friends, we are back with my ComGrow large honeycomb bed and my awesome little 3D printed lines and bed pins. Friends, we're gonna use this little straight line guide to make that project go a lot faster. So if you haven't seen these before, I climb Mount Pisgah almost every day and I leave a keychain on the back. On the front it says Mount Pisgah. On the back it's got the info about the channel. Friends, the other day I showed how we can put the names on the back and because I line it up right here, it is super slick to reset up. We are going to be even smarter and today we're going to do four at a time. In order to assist keeping this straight, I'm going to do a couple shift nudges to get this out of my way for a second and let me show you. I have just added a pin here so I can keep that side more straight as well. Of course we do need to have them facing the right way. So now it is real easy to get those square. One other cool thing about this design is these are each 20 millimeters. So that's gonna help us a lot on the next part of the project. Of course, friends, before we get too far, let's check the height of our setup. Make sure we keep those all stacked in there. Lower it down, tighten it up. And of course, put it right back where it belongs. Friends, this is Light Burn. If you're not using it, I do recommend it. We're gonna do file open because I've already started this project. And we're gonna do the four stacked Mount Fiske keychain backs. So you can see here, we'll zoom in. This is my information and the little YouTube logo. Friends, now let's use the move command to get over to where we need to be to build this. I will let you know that these are 20 millimeters apart. I did that with the simple nudge tool. I had it set at 10 millimeters, so it was super slick. Do a shift nudge. And now I'll do the normal nudges to get it exactly lined up. I am going from the middle, it shows right now. I'm gonna change that to the bottom corner. That's where I want it for this one. Let's do a quick frame and see how close we are. That's pretty amazing. I uh, did not think I'd be there that quick. I'm gonna do a couple more control clicks to go to the left. This time I'm gonna do the round frame. Notice that traces the top and the bottom. I think I'm going to do one more control left. Once again, let's hit that frame. I'm going to do the normal one this time. Friends, it was that slick. Of course, it is time to grab some goggles and let's make something magical. Alrighty friends, so I'm gonna do a shift nudge to the left. That way we can pick them up and check them out to see just how they turned out. Friends, friends, there you have it. Sweet keychains, Mount Pisca on the front, my information on the back, four at a time. How cool is that? Friends, don't forget if you visit my website, hlmodtech.com and move out to the Lasers Project page, you can download those honeycomb bed pins. Also, if you want to modify them, you can click right up here on the honeycomb bed pin. You will immediately arrive at the Tinkercad project page. Don't forget, reactions are always appreciated and you can hit copy and tinker to modify it 
to meet your specifications. Of course, if you're just starting in Tinkercad, you can check up here for the link where I show you a little bit of how to edit it. Friends, of course, I hope you totally enjoyed the video, and if you did, please give it a like. Please also hit that share button so more people can learn about HL Mod Tech. Don't forget you absolutely make my day if you take time to leave a comment down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button, and last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.